So it's definitely kind of amazing how Alpha Investments knows so much from these trillion dollar companies, right? Like Amazon, he's got insiders and Hasbro, the company that he's been on record for saying he wants to hostile take over Hasbro of him and his Timmy's, right? And the one unbelievable thing he said was that the Amazon and Hasbro, they are no longer going to dump magic cards. Wow. Imagine that. I mean, what are they going to do on these sales then? You know, Amazon Prime Day. They have two Prime Days. They have Fall Sale Day. They just have random dump days. I mean, they don't even have names for them anymore. Obviously, we're going to Cyber Monday. And right before he posted a video, ironically, they had another dump. As you can see from the comments in his video that they dumped uh, Brothers War Collector's Edition. Alpha Investment would charge you 180, maybe 200. Uh, Amazon charged you 130. So again, very interesting, very strange, and in, in all honesty, this is the Amazon. Amazon will continue to dump until, you know, I mean, I don't know. I mean, Amazon will just continue to dump. Uh, there's no reason for them not to. They have Hasbro by the balls, like I'd mentioned before. Um, Amazon is selling a lot of items that Hasbro needs them to sell. Board games, Transformer figures, Marvel Legends, whatever else. I mean, their entire operation is based online is basically Amazon. I would probably imagine Amazon makes up 50%, if not more, of their online sales. Now, they do ha have Hasbro Direct, but in terms of volume, Amazon will always be king. And he made this video, uh, I know this video is coming a little after, so I'm trying to predict, but he made this video on Sunday night-ish before Cyber Monday. Kind of a risky call, right, to be able to say this, and then right before he made, he published it, so who knows when he made the video, right? Um, but when he published the video, one hour before, they actually had Dump Brothers War, Collector's Edition, like I mentioned. It's quite funny. Uh, I definitely think in terms of what is going on here, I think um, you, you have to really consider what Anthony, or what, I'm oh, sorry, <laughs> Anthony, he's sitting in jail now. He's that, That's my other channel, LUS, that is far more successful, right, than this channel as the dog is back to barking. Um my God, it's hard to make videos about alpha investment. It seems that that dog really doesn't want me to make videos. My neighbor's dog, uh, he won't stop barking. And I don't know why he's been barking for the last God who knows how long, right? Probably last two nights. Uh, actually, you know what? No, it was um, Thanksgiving. It was Wednesday. I think they went away and then the dog came back. I don't know. Uh, regardless, um, I don't know how... Alpha Investments has this inside information. I don't know why he would trust the source that has not been named. A lot of people are now understanding that what he's saying is lies. Like, how how does he know? How does he know specifically that Amazon, this trillion dollar company, is going to not dump magic cards anymore? So on Prime Day, you know, and this is a very risky thing to say right before Cyber Monday. And then you have Christmas, right? Then you have New Year's, which are two possible dump dates. And the main dump date is Amazon Prime. You know, the, the Prime prices, you're talking about $60 for Neon Dynasty. I got uh, Crimson Vow for $40, 50 I, I buy. At that time, I had a store and they were selling for 40% off distribution prices. Even if you take Aftermath, I think he loves Aftermath, doesn't he? Like, am I incorrect in saying that this guy was promoting Aftermath, which is a $180 box that he was probably selling distribution price, and now he, it is a $80, $90 box in Amazon, which means you lost more than 50%, and you, all, you paid money to lose money, right? That's the beauty of Alpha Investments, right? You pay money to lose even more money. So... Uh, my neighbor's dog probably doesn't want me to produce more videos about this, and maybe some of you won't want it either. But I'm just here to say that it's kind of interesting. Um, it's something where, like, 
like if you believe this is true and you believe that him and his Timmies are going to hostile takeover, you know, I've never heard of a hostile takeover where the dude who's going to take it over owns probably less than half a percent and he's announcing that the hostile takeover is going to happen. Yeah, that is not how hostile takeovers work. Typically, you got to work in the shadows until you have a large percent. And then you might want to purchase the other ones in the open market for way more money than they're currently worth. Because what you're buying is you're buying control, not necessarily just stocks. So anyway, I think Alpha Investments really has, you know, this, I mean, the fact that people believe he knows Amazon. The fact that people believe that he ha has some type of insider, right, who's always been wrong about mythic editions and all this stuff. I mean, this insider sure is wrong a lot. It's almost like he is himself the insider and he's making the news based on information to help him sell more cardboard, right? Like I said, man, you don't need to buy no cardboard right now. Prices are tight. You know, spend time with your loved ones, spend time with your family. Spend time with your dogs and kids and stuff like that. The last thing you need is more cardboard, right? You know, talking to somebody who I talk, I own a shit ton of cardboard, probably over a mil, million dollars in cardboard. Um, it's not going to make you happy. It's not going to make you rich. It's going to make you poor. It's going to make you broke. And when you try to sell it, it's impossible to sell because l no one wants to buy it. You know, the liquidity is a issue that Alpha Investment has never, ever addressed, and he still refuses to address, is how is these lemmings supposed to sell when he's the one dumping it on other lemmings? Like, it's the same cards, guys. The cards that you would be selling are the same sets that he already has tons of. Anyway, bye, guys.